Hi everybody, this is C3 Readings and hi Leo. Let's see what messages will show up for you guys. What do we have for Leo, please? Leo, I feel like there's going to be a lot of focus on your money over the course of the next few days, your, you know, your social status, your fame. I also see expansion in your um like romantic relationships, but there could be somebody new that you're going to meet, okay? Um I I feel like this is nice. Like I see a sense a sense of expansion even within you as a person, okay? I kind of feel like I see you in this energy where you're the star of the show and a lot of people are noticing you at the present moment. So we have grief, imagination, and abundance. Okay, so there is something that still hurts you a little bit, but this is saying that I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. I feel like this card is telling you to be in the present moment. And to me it also looks like leo you're going through a realization okay um imagination and abundance i embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind then you have abundance i'm a limitless being and i can manifest whatever i desire in this physical reality so what what i'm really seeing here um leo is that a lot of you are able to manifest what you desire and there is a lot of there is a lot of focus on manifestation and law of attraction and all that. Some of you could be working on that or watching videos about it or I don't know. Like, And if you're not doing it, then both of these cards are telling you to use it. Okay, you have a tool here. Um, this is also telling you to raise your vibration because in the present moment i'm really getting leo what you're thinking about you will manifest it very quick so yeah this is about that but we will see what do we have for leo Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. All right. So the next is it is safe for you to love. Positive. Sorry. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. So, okay, Leo. So both of these cards are telling you to open your heart space for love. I kind of feel like a lot of you are having a hard time opening up to love maybe. Or you're not that focused on it. But, you know, with both of these energies coming together, I'm kind of getting that there is something in love that is um, showing up for you evidently here, okay? All right, what do we have for Leo? seeing the empress card at the bottom of the deck so this is the clarity that you have been seeking that's coming towards you 
as you expanding as you growing this is a very good omen here okay Ooh. so what i'm seeing for you is that um, you're a little bit like closed off okay a little bit suspicious or it's like this energy of also tired like some of you are energetically drained um it's like you're just at the verge of giving up on something okay why do i feel like leo you haven't been feeling like yourself lately okay you've been feeling very tired and demotivated about something um so a lot of passion and you know that sense of creativity that you used to have you feel like it is lost or you've been feeling lost but again you know the thing is that this is telling you to step back into your part and to you know to be the leo that you are okay we'll see what happened in the past okay maybe there was an opportunity in the past okay um Now, for some of you, this opportunity already showed up and for others of you, it is about to show up because the Ace of Pentacles is connected to the Queen of Pentacles here, which talks about growth, expansion and even, you know, uh, respect. I feel like for some of you, you could be gaining a lot of respect. Like it's it's like this energy of um, honor, respect, um, recognition for your work, a very stable energy. I also feel like some of you could be taking pride in your achievements in the future. This is not your present energy, okay? Leo you have a goal that you want to achieve there's something that you want to get to or there's something on your mind that you're wanting to attain and I feel like for a lot of you you will be able to get it and I'm also getting Leo that you're in this energy where I don't feel like you're very open to like love but you are just open to new possibilities okay um with the three of cups energy this is a sense of celebration this is a sense of like okay i just want to be happy i want to have a good time kind of an energy uh some of you this is a side message leo but some of you could be missing a friend of yours these days okay you want to really talk to a friend of yours like somebody you used to know um I feel like, you know, at the present moment, you may be finding it hard to really see where this is taking you. But as your reading is progressing, Leo, I'm really seeing that you're going to be happy about it. Like whatever it is that's unfolding for you, I feel like you're going to be happy. Okay. Um, you're going to feel joyous about it. It's a very joyful energy. Let's see. Ooh, the five of cups to the five of pentacles leo there's a lot of sadness and you know feeling left out feeling lonely um some of you maybe it is about your finances or it is about love i don't know i feel like it's a mixture of both um you're not feeling like yourself a lot of you are feeling that you're not where you are supposed to be financially or i don't know like emotionally as well there's a sense of sadness and grief but five and five it represents some form of a challenge but also a change okay so whatever this energy is i, I don't feel like it's permanent of course this will change for you in the future but yeah there is you know this sense of feeling like I don't know, like this is feeling lost kind of an energy. Let's see what is up with your person. Six of Pentacles, Nine of Cups. Okay, um, this is somebody who really feels passionate about you still and they want to give into the situation. I feel like this person is going to show up for you, Nine of Cups.
Oh my goodness, your outcome is the Two of Cups. Now that Two of Cups has showed up for everybody in this set of readings. Uh, a lot of people are getting love or there's like a cycle in love here. Uh, Ten of Wands to the Four of Swords. I feel like Leo, whatever is showing up in love for you, you are not expecting it and you're healing, okay? I kind of feel like you're silent, you are by yourself. There's this energy of I'm going to heal myself, I'm going to work on myself. Um, some of you are very focused on like, I don't know, like, is it work-related burden or is it something else? Okay, but there's a lot of burden that you have been carrying and I feel like moving towards the future, you will just choose to take a step back from it. Some of you might be just needing some break, okay? But I feel like you're healing. This is like an energy of I'm fine by myself, you know. I'm okay with whatever's going on and, you know, I've made peace with, okay, this is how things are going to be. And the Two of Cups is like, boom, love shows up. What is the advice for Leo? Strength, which is you. Ace of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Uh, the, you know... <laughs> Leo, with the strength and the knight of wands here, I feel like this is telling you to connect back to yourself. A lot of you have been feeling very lost. A lot of you have also been feeling not like yourself lately. So this, you know, this is telling you to connect to yourself, connect to your higher self. This is also a lot of self-love kind of an energy. So this is like finding yourself and trusting your intuition. Being authentic to who you are, what is, you know, what is vibing with you. That's it, Leo. Those were the messages that showed up for you. Um, your extended will be linked below if you're interested. Do give this video a like and subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed. Take care and bye-bye.